fact question. Can we make our own mint chocolate macaron recipe? Hi. Today we are going to try to make our own mint chocolate macaron recipe. We said try. This is try number one, so who knows how this will turn out. One fourth cup regular sugar. Half a cup almond flour. Two tablespoons unsweetened cocoa powder. A pinch of salt. And two egg whites. For the filling, you'll need any homemade mint frosting recipe. This is ours right here. Pause the video if you need to write it down. And now for the tools. The tools you will need are cookie sheets, parchment paper, a sifter, any mixer, but we're using a KitchenAid stand mixer, two large mixing bowls, and Wilton piping bags. To make, to make the, the dough, dough, we, we need, need to, to make, make a meringue. meringue. To make a meringue, you need to mix your egg whites until frothy. These are our frothy egg whites. And add sugar until stiff peaks form. Those are stiff peaks. Now we sift the powdered sugar. This is our sifted powdered sugar. And now to sift the almond flour. And now the cocoa powder. These are our sifted ingredients. Now we are folding this into the meringue one third bowl at a time. Afterwards, this is what our meringue turns out to look like. Then you put it in the bag. Snip the tip and pipe. After piping, let them sit for 30 to 40 minutes so they can develop a skin. These are them in the oven. Look, look at their, their feet. feet. These are all the not survivors. I Say something, I'm giving up on you. So there weren't enough cookies for us to actually put a top on it and make it like an actual macaron, but we tried, and we know next time to make double. Okay, they're not perfect okay. looking, but we'll see how they taste. One, two, two three. <gasps> mm. <laughs> they taste like the mint hot chocolate you buy at the store. Mm. Actually, I haven't had that before. Huh? <laughs> no. Well, it's good anyway. Mm. Eat all the frosting. <laughs> hey, that's my brother. <laughs>